Welcome back to STL TV Live. I'm Lauren Watt. Now joining me in the studio is Rod Jones from Grace Hill. He's here to talk about the fifth annual Whitaker Urban Evening Series. Rod, thank you very much for joining us today. Thank you, Lauren, for having us. Tell us a little bit, for those who may not know, a little bit about Grace Hill and its background. Absolutely. Grace Hill started out in uh, 1903, and we were founded as an outgrowth of the Episcopal Diocese here in St. Louis. And we started out really helping to help and individuals and communities and families grow stronger so that families and individuals can be more self-reliant and be able to participate in social mobility to grow and to do better financially. And so we've been serving the city of St. Louis for over a century doing that work in a variety of areas, both health care, uh, early childhood development, job employment readiness and placement, housing redevelopment and community renewal, really with the tradition of engaging neighbors and citizens in their own destiny setting. And now there are different branches that you just discussed. A lot of people know Grace Hill over off of Newstead and Carter in there. Oh, yeah. but, and you're president and CEO of one of the branches. Talk about the area you're over. Sure. So uh, several years ago, um, given the government regulation, we divided the organization in two. So I'm CEO of Grace Hill Settlement House, and then there's Grace Hill Health Centers. And so when you ride around town, you may see one of our 18 facilities around. So we operate 18 facilities uh, providing health care, which are primarily neighborhood-based, and then we operate in about seven St. Louis public schools. Now, you said you're in charge of the shelter part? The settlement house. The settlement house. What, what is that about? Yep, so the settlement house typically works in communities, really working in partnership with neighbors and other stakeholders like uh, schools and banks to make sure that all of the systems work together so that people fa and families grow stronger. So our mission really on our side is really to provide opportunities for families to be stronger um, and healthier and to be more self-reliant. Okay, very good. Now the location over there on Carter and Pope, uh, what is that location? That is one of the health centers. That is one of the health yeah, centers. Yeah, well, right now you'll probably ride around town and we have a couple of new facilities coming up. Uh, we just opened one on Grand and Flores and our whole new campus is up there. So we'll be providing everything from affordable child care to job readiness and training as well as a state-of-the-art health facility and housing renewal. Okay, now how did you get involved with the Whitaker Foundation? Yeah, absolutely. So in uh, 2007, Grace Hill, as part of its real desire to bring people back into North St. Louis uh, and to engage neighbors as part of community renewal and community development and to create great destinations in North St. Louis, actually uh, approached the Whitaker Foundation, who sponsors one of, this is one of the many concert series throughout the summer, uh, as an opportunity for us to create great destinations. And with people coming into town, it allows also for some economic development, Crown Candy and some of the other vendors that are there at the park. Okay, now where, where does your funding come from? Primarily, Grace Hill's funding comes mostly from, from federal government contracts. Uh, we do receive some state money and contributions as well as some fee for service. Okay, we're about out of uh, time for this half, but when we come back, we're gonna talk about the Grace Hill and the uh, Whitaker Foundation and the music that's gonna be happening. You got a free concert. Don't go anywhere. We have more with Rod Jones here after this. Remember to keep up with STL TV and the great events going on around St. Louis. Friend us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can always watch us streaming live on stltv.net. We'll be right back after more.